Was it in the cave after all? Did I just waste my time? Worms fun here. Oh, wait, that there's multiple. <laughs> On the bright side, if I remember right, this is all copper here, and I need that too. cave. If I was ever making a cave base, this would probably be it. I hear a pig. Yes, here it is. Now the question is, this gives me how long? Two hours, five minutes. And this gives me two hours five minutes. It doesn't matter at all. All right. While well, that's working on that, let's see what we got. for I only know that I haven't seen anything yet. I might regret not collecting them later, but yeah. I just don't see anything they'd be used for. Also I do I want to explore this. I kinda do. I got some time to kill. Looks like this place might be a dead end. Just more resources, which, I mean, that's not a bad thing. Especially if keeps handing up this copper. Dangerous. especially useful, but it's a thing. How amazing would that have been if that one was copper? 
Ja, war. Also, I'm assuming I'm gonna need a lot more like, copper after I make this bench too. Because, of course, electronics and copper wire kind of go hand in hand. <laughs> you can use aluminum and gold wiring for a lot of things, but I mean, there's a reason copper is so popular. But personally, if I could use gold for pretty much every wire in this game, I probably would. Purely because I have that deep ore deposit of gold right next to my base. Just make everything out of gold and sulfur. <laughs> Building out of sulfur is a terrible idea, but oh well. Oh, so. I like how that's the cave. And the rest is like, oh, no, you're out in the open. I bet I mean the light, not the cave effect. there if I was actually just playing that with Max. Now, unfortunately, I didn't write down how much aluminum I need. So I'm about to do a little bit quick maths. That doesn't need it. Okay, good. So I need is 40. And I just need electronics. Don't need it, so. And I used 8, and I needed 10. Okay. So once I get 18 from that, I will head back. And then probably regret it shortly after. Parasites. See, so yeah, I mean, if you didn't mind having your stamina go to nothing because of pneumonia, this would be a nice lo base location. It's pretty charming. Halfway there. I'm leaving the iron because I don't have inventory space. Do I realize the irony in me saying that I never ran out of inventory space before now? Yes. Yes, I do.
Also, next time I come here, I might bring a bunch of ladders and put them right here. Make an easy way down. Don't have to jump like that. <laughs> Saw me through the wall, huh? That is what we call cheats. You shouldn't do that, it's bad. No. I have more space than I thought. You take you, drop you. Don't really use my sticks. Huh. Bison. Oh. This a uh, sulfur? I might move my base up here if this is actually right here. Got copper, aluminum, sulfur. If I remember right, there was a gold one nearby. Oh, it's underground. He's probably in a cave. Is there a cave over here? there maybe I don't think I'll actually move the base I'll probably just put a little outpost up here with some solar panels or something maybe winter but oh Lead into that cave or another one? I gotta check this out. At least my food's wearing off. Oh right, I completely forgot about the that right there. This is where that leads. Oh, if that would actually stop the fall damage or not. Yeah, so I might build a ladder right there. Much easier to build a ramp going from there to up here, and a ladder going up, than it would be to make a ladder over there and keep going into cave entrance. If I ever want the cold, that is. Three more, come on. I'm just gonna leave this here, by the way. those things pop out of. There's not really any around. So it'd just be the Drax that fell into that hole up there. Next time I come here there probably would be worms again, but they're really not a big threat. And they only pop out when I'm nearby from the looks of it, so I doubt they would attack this while I'm not here. One more. 
One more. Come on. Honestly, that would probably get storm damage now that I think about it, so it probably is better to stay over here. No. Little further back. I just gave myself a mini heart attack there. stamina bar. Holy heck. That hurts. <laughs> oh no. Uh. Noted, do not change your gear while on the ladder. I broke my leg. <laughs> uh, depending on the time, I might just do a jump cut to when I get to the base, so... Let me... You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna do a jump cut to when I get to the base. There's... Maybe not, because <laughs> then you would have missed that. Yeah, it'll attract the predators. I want to attract the things into the cave. Uh. Yeah, this is just more compressed. So, be honest, do you think I was about to die there? 
Uh, that would have been an interesting first death. <laughs> now, uh, I think you make a splint on your person, right? <laughs> I make one. There it is. Six rope. I think I can make one. Let me just drop this for now. But craftable. Jaguar. <laughs> really? One of the meats spoiled so you're dropping them on the floor. <laughs> Not nice. <laughs> I have a broken leg. You know, it's probably gonna time out the broken leg before <laughs> I make this splint. going to show how many predators were just out here waiting for me. So I'm going to say it's a good thing I did that. <laughs> we done? <laughs> Are we done, please? Pretty high. Hmm. Stringy meat. Sure, I'll take that. Considering how much of it there is. No space for bones. Drop you then. That face will appear in my nightmares tonight. Just peeking out from the pig. PlayStation again. Tough. I remember right, you guys are the fatty T bone. No, you guys are the ribs. Okay. Yeah, so no point. I'll probably make this larger when I turn it into stone. Oh boy. Oh, that must be Daisy. <laughs> I was like, wait, why is there a player marker at my house? Uh, 
Uh, also, at this point, I'm pretty sure Daisy's completely useless. Just like a pack animal or something. But pet factor. She's my pet, so. But she stays. Looks deep enough, right? I'm about to get bit by a fish again, aren't I? No. <laughs> One of these days I'll probably try the fishing. Also, it's probably obvious by now that I decided not to do the jump cut. <laughs> really? Already a storm. Fair enough. I mean, then again, you can't really salt it all together. Does it even matter? Everyone just popping this at the end of that last video because it looks like Streamlabs crashed again. I'm really gonna have to find out what's the problem with that thing. Anyways, you didn't really miss much. I got home. I crafted this thing. I put it too close, so I moved it out here. Ran a wire into the window. 
and this is now working. You can see on the bar, my stuff is all repaired. Plus I couldn't repair my armor, so maybe I'll get to show you what this does. Let's see. Yeah. So I can't do the all with this, but you see, I click or repair, it works. It's nice. So yeah, now I don't have to worry about just losing my equipment to it not being repaired. Anyways, I was also talking about how the next goal is going to be making the composites so that we can do this quest. Need platinum, need titanium, need composites, need more electronics, blah blah blah. <laughs> I'm currently making the glass, so that's not a problem. Glass is just from smelting silica. It's right here. Once I have everything ready, I will accept that quest, and then the quest after that, we should get red exotics. It's also the most uh, appropriate way to farm it because I think it gives you like a hundred. So there's pretty much no point in getting it in other ways. You just do a quick run, grab some corpses, leave, get like a hundred red exotic. So yeah, no point in anything else. We just need to work our way up here, which means, of course, more aluminum. And some titanium, which I think there's a cave up here that has titanium, but don't quote me on that. I'll find out later. Okay, anyways, that's all I wanted to say. There was a whole lot more, but like I said, OBS crashed again, so. Oh well. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. And yeah, that'll be the end of this session. Why? <laughs> he doesn't want me to go, apparently. Ah, but anyways. I guess like the video to support me <laughs> with all these crashes happening because I need some encouragement. <laughs> uh. Not really, but also kinda. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'll see if I can find out anything that's going on because yeah, OBS has just been pretty garbage lately really hope it has an update or something that fixes all of this. If they don't, then I guess I'll probably look into different recording software. Because, yeah, this is getting to be kind of ridiculous. Get out of there. <sighs> Anyways. Thank you for watching, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.